Hi, welcome to Coastal Update, presented to you by the A-Team, John and Susan Andrews with Remax of Gulf Shores at Peninsula. They stay on top of the market with decades of experience helping you make great choices. Let's take a look at the market. This is our report for the single family residential real estate market along the beautiful Alabama Gulf Coast, the area we call Pleasure Island, consisting of Gulf Shores, Orange Beach, Fort Morgan, and Perdido Key in Florida. We've gathered all the data from the Ball and Realtors database, so let's jump in and see how the market is. This chart shows inventory, or the number of homes that are listed for sale, and on October the 1st, it stood at 569 units. You can see it was only at 492 the same time last year, and 400 two years ago, so inventory continues to increase. This chart shows the number of days it takes to get a properly priced home under contract, and it stood at 77 days. Here's home sales for the last two years on a month-by-month -month basis. It dropped to 55 homes that actually changed hands in the month of September here on Pleasure Island. Here we're looking at the first three quarters of 2024 versus the same time period last year. Total number of home sales down about 20% to just over 750 homes. Once again, average sales price and median price are holding steady, showing a 3 and 8% increase respectively. The median price, meaning half were above and half were below, stood at $565,000. The average dollars per square foot rose 9% to $359 per heated and cooled square foot. Next, we measure demand by looking at how many units are marked under contract or pending. It was 152 on October the 1st last year, down 37% to only 96 units we expect to see close in the next 30 to 45 days. We appreciate you watching Coastal Update. Contact the REMAX of Gulf Shores Agents to provide you with this video so they can help you make great choices. Until then, we'll see you next month.